Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brittany. And if this is your first time stumbling across one of my videos, I focus on fashion, beauty, luxury, lifestyle, fragrances, and pretty much whatever else I feel like talking about. So if that seems like something that you may be interested in, please think about clicking on that subscribe button if you enjoy the content, of course. Also, if you're already a subscriber, go ahead and click on that notification bell. I usually upload twice a week, which is Sundays and Thursdays, so I don't want you to miss a video. So for today, I have a boot haul for y'all and I'm super excited. Listen, it's definitely boot season and the girls are saying it ain't cheap, okay? But I actually got some really good deals on these boots. A lot of these boots I got um, during the Black Friday Cyber Monday sale and then I have one special pair of boots that you guys have already seen on Instagram and we'll talk about those as well. So if you are interested in seeing what I picked up, then stick around. Okay, y'all, so the first pair of boots I picked up are from Gucci and Balenciaga. You guys have already seen these, so we won't spend too much time on them. However, I have already worn them. I love them. You guys know if you've been following me for a while, I absolutely love Balenciaga, their shoes, the clothing, and everything. So when they did this collab, I'm not going to lie to y'all, I wasn't like that excited because I'm like, mm, I probably won't buy anything. But when I saw the boots, I was like, that's a piece that I can add to my wardrobe and it like you know I have a little piece of the collection but it's also something that I think can be a classic for me so I picked up the boots and I'm super excited to show y'all here they are y'all how good are these now I know you may be thinking honey what is Brittany doing with the kitten listen listen so these particular boots came in um two lengths so they have the short knife style boot which does have like a stretch I guess neoprene type of material and this is the heel height on the shorter version now on the taller version the heel height is taller um, which I prefer however I just wasn't sure about the taller version how they would look on me I'm really short and I have a hard time sometimes with boots being too tall on me even though those are super stretched if it was gonna like sit under my butt cheek that probably wouldn't have worked out and on top of that they were $1,200 more than these so I was like I'll, I'd rather take a chance on these than the others and the others were really hard to get so these I was able to actually purchase online and I think these retail for around $1,200 um, and I've worn them already they are super comfortable they look so good I will insert a picture here so you guys can see them but I'm super happy that I got these y'all they look so good and like I said um to me, these can be a classic piece. I can have a piece of the collection, which is fairly trendy, but with the large GGs all over them um, and just the classic colorway of the Gucci, I think these can really go a long way in my wardrobe. On top of that, they're comfortable. One thing about me and boots, I really like comfortable boots. I'm harder on boots, you know? I'm like trekking around and it's not like a pump or something like that. So I, I really feel like I'll get a lot of wear out of these. I've already worn them twice um, and I probably had them maybe two weeks, maybe. But they're really cute, y'all. So I'm super excited about these. I do wish the heel was a little bit higher, but the boot is so fierce. I don't think it really takes away from it once it's on your foot, okay? Because I know this looks a little bit crazy. <laughs> but once they are on, they look really good and it's still, it's still a bomb boot. I guess I can show y'all the packaging. So they did give me like this little linen tote bag. Um, I don't know if these come in all of the new Gucci purchases, but this is kind of cool. You can kind of like... <laughs> get your groceries or something in this or you know if you need to like just take a few things around with you it's a nice little linen tote and these are the dust bags which are really cool so on one side they have the gucci and then the other side is the balenciaga dust bag so i thought that was really cool and interesting i wasn't really expecting that um but i didn't do a lot of research on this collection so i really didn't know what to expect when it came to the packaging but I just love the boots, y'all. I'm so happy that I got them. And yeah, you guys were loving them on Instagram as well. I did a reel. And like I said, I took a couple of pictures. So um, yeah, let me know what y'all think. And also, did you guys pick up anything from this collection? What are some of your favorites? They have this bag that I saw, um, this girl post. She is a YouTuber. I cannot think of her name. Um, but it had the same large GG logo and it had the bamboo handle. I can't find that bag anywhere. 
and I need it for these boots, okay? But yeah, love these boots so much, so I'm happy that I got those. Okay, so I also picked up a pair of Gian Vito Rossi boots. I've been living for these boots for so long. I could never find these in my size, um, and I finally found them, and on sale. They were going for $690, and I got them for 30% off during the Black Friday sale. And these boots are kind of old, maybe two years or so, but y'all, they're so good, okay? And let me see, what are they called? These are called the Caffness Boot in black. And I got these in a 37 and a half. Those Gucci boots, I got those in a size 38. But these I got in a um, seven and a half because I have really small ankles, y'all. It's really crazy. My ankles and my wrists are really tiny. So when it comes to like things like this, the size 38, they were loose around my ankle. And that's why it was so hard for me to find the 37 and a half. Um, and I didn't like all that slack that these gave. But yes, get into these boots. Let me zip them up for y'all. Y'all, how sexy are these? So these are mesh boots. Okay, they look like a pump with the mesh, but I like, I just love the shape of these. The heel is healing okay it is a good heel this is like a comfortable heel for me when it comes to boots and Gian Vito Rossi shoes are super comfortable so you don't usually have to worry about them hurting your feet now if you're not used to wearing heels I mean a heel is still a heel so keep that in mind but these are so sexy to me y'all so they have the exposed gold zipper on the side kind of like a chunky zipper and it's lined in leather the heel is also covered in leather and I just I'm obsessed okay they look so good with like leather pants and uh jeans just such a cute boot so I cannot wait to wear these totally worth it okay I'm so happy that I finally have these because I've been looking for these for the longest time okay for the longest time so yeah really really cute I haven't worn them yet but I've worn them around the house a little bit just to get a feel and I'm obsessed okay so yeah these are called the calfness if I can find these I will link them down below for y'all but yes honey mm, so happy that I have these finally okay y'all so these are the next boots I got now these are from a brand that I've never heard of but they are by Bianca D I believe and I've been looking for a pair of like cognac boots like this um in real leather I have a pair that kind of remind you of like Amina Mawadis, but they have a clear heel, a little bit more trendy, and also they are faux leather. I got them from like Public Desire a couple years ago. So I've been needing a nice pair of cognac boots, and these y'all are very affordable. They were down to like $200, and then I got them for 30% off. The leather on these boots is so soft. It's insane. Like, these boots are made so well the heel height not too high at all but you know it's just a nice boot that if you're missing this color in your wardrobe this is gonna do the trick you know what i'm saying it's not like a a standout boot but the color is luscious okay the color is so luscious it's literally the same color as my loewe belt um the what is it called? The corset belt, I guess. Um, so it's perfect to wear with those. Like if I wear like a nice cream dress with the Loewe belt, throw these on, throw me a cute little bag and I'm good to go. These also fit really well. Um, they do have a natural kind of slouch vibe um they're wrinkled like that so it's nice when you put them on you know even if they slouch down a little bit more it's fine they look really good on very comfortable i mean y'all i'm super excited about these now i did pick these up in a size 38 because of course you can wear really thick socks and stuff with them in the winter time but so cute can y'all see i'm still using my vlogging camera so um yeah I hope y'all can see these, but so cute, y'all. I love these boots so much. I'm glad I got them. I kind of went back and forth because I was like, it's not like a boot that like stands out, but the color was given. So I kind of waited a little while and I'm so glad they still had them in my size. But yeah, I highly recommend these and this brand, honestly, because they're very well made. Okay, y'all. So next up, is there something on this camera? Oh my gosh, if it is, I'm sorry, y'all. But as you can see, this box can barely fit in the frame, girl. I picked up a couple pair of uh, pairs of Texas boots and don't you just love this big old pink box, even though I'm gonna get rid of it, but the box is so pretty. So I picked up two pair of the same style and let me show y'all. So this is the first pair. Look at these boots, girl. Woo, this is a boot, okay? This 
is a boot. Now, I've been seeing these, um, this particular color for a, a little while. However, I did not want to pay full price for these because Paris, Texas boots, they range in pricing, um, especially like when you look on Farfetch and stuff like that. So some of these I've seen for like six, then I saw them for like 780 and all of that. And I'm like, I'm not paying that. So I waited it out. I used Karma. Y'all know I love Karma. So I added them um, to my little list. And when they went on sale on Moda Operandi, I went ahead and got them. Y'all, these boots went from $780 down to $495, okay? Uh, can't beat it with a stick. The heel is so good. The shape of this boot is so good. Now, the reason why I was pressed to get these particular boots is because you guys know I have my um, mini Jody from Bottega. And honestly, I thought it was going to be the exact same color. It's not. I can probably get away with it, but I really thought that it was going to be the exact same color, girl. But I feel like my Bottega Jody bag is a little bit darker. So yeah, that's kind of a bummer. But the boot is so sexy and so cute on. I'm definitely going to keep them. And they are just... Girl, the croc emboss, like, let me put one down. The croc emboss on this boot. They did what was supposed to be done, okay? It's just such a sexy boot. It's leather all on the inside. I mean, leather sole. The heel is sick. Like, I am obsessed with these boots. Now, I did get these in a 38 and a half, okay? So, I'm going to have to wear super thick socks with these, but I got them in a 38 and a half because I have another pair that I'm going to show y'all. And I got those in a size 38, okay? And they fit me in the foot, but in the calf, it's like, oh, it's kind of suffocating. So, I'm definitely going to get those stretched out because I love the color of those so much. But I got these in a 38 and a half, and this was the only size that they had anyway. So, I was like, I'm getting it, you know, because I've been waiting on them. It does have a little bit of slouch on me because my legs are so short, but um, I love these, okay? And if you hear banging, girl, okay, we're getting things put up in here, curtains and all of that, so I'm sorry. <laughs> but um, yeah, these boots are so good. So happy that I have this color. And you can wear these like in the spring, fall. You can wear them all year round because the color is just so popping, right? I'm obsessed. Oh, the craftsmanship on these, crazy. So like I said, I did pick up two pairs. So this is my second pair, and this is actually the first pair that I got. And I got these in a size 38. I picked these up from Farfetch um, because I was doing a campaign with them. Y'all. <laughs> Do you see this boot, girl? Oh, this is rich sex. I'm so sorry. This boot. Look at this boot. It's insane. The color is so elegant and just rich, right? Ah, oh, it's the wine color. So beautiful. Actually, what is the name of the color? The color is called Glossy Rouge Noir. Perfect. Okay. So it's like a black and cherry kind of color. I absolutely love these, y'all. These are so good. Now, I wish I would have got these in a 38 and a half because the calf on these is a little bit tight on my leg. Um, but I'm going to get them stretched out a little bit because they don't have zippers or anything. You just pull this style on. So these should be easy um, to stretch out just a little bit, you know, especially if you want to wear them with jeans and stuff like that. But these boots are so fire. I cannot. I cannot. And I got these because I wanted them to go with my Lady Dior that I picked up when I was in Chicago. Color is a little off but the boot is still sick. So I love these so much. Um, love the Paris, Texas brand. I feel like their boots are made so well and they're very classic. You know, it's not too much going on, but um, it's definitely a standout piece, just the way that it looks. Look at, oh, girl, the boot. This is a boot. Mm, 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 mm. But yeah, can't wait to wear these. I cannot wait. I still got to get them stretched out though. Now, if you thought that last box was big, I can't even barely hold this box. This box is so big and these shoes are so freaking heavy. You probably already know what they are because I did a poll on Instagram and these are the ones that y'all chose. I had two pair of brown boots, okay? One from Paris, Texas and these D squared ones. Y'all... These boots are sick. Bro, we can only hold one because the boot is so robust, okay? 
Look at this boot. So these are the brown suede fringe boots from D Squared. They do have like a thicker heel, so very comfortable. I love the chocolate brown color. It's a cowboy boot, girl. And you know I'm from Nashville, so we do cowboy boots here, okay? This boot is absolutely sickening. However, now I do feel like these are a lot, okay? These are a lot. I'm actually going to wear these today. Oh, but these are a lot for a boot. So that's why I was going back and forth between the Paris, Texas one, because I'll put a picture up. They had just fringe at the very top, but I did not like the length of the boot. It was showing too much in the front and with the dip. These are higher on the leg and they just looked a little bit better in my opinion. So... I didn't think they were both worth having. I feel like kind of, but not really. So yeah, I went ahead and returned those and I kept these because y'all was like, definitely get, you know, keep these boots. So I went with y'all's suggestion. And of course I saw my girl Janae in these um, and she killed them. So they're gorgeous boots, very comfortable. And yeah, I love them. Now these are called the Taglia boot and I got these in a size 38. And let me just tell you how I came up on this deal. So I was looking for brown suede boots and that's when I found the Paris, Texas ones. Then I saw these and they only had 138 left. I'm like, let me just try it out. Girl, these boots were on sale for $400. I think these boots usually retail for like 12, I think. I'm not quite sure, but if I find them, I will definitely link them. I've seen a lot of these, but they've had like different color fringe on them and I do not like those. So it's kind of like the brown boot, but the inside of the fringe is like a tan color. And I'm like, that's really doing too much. But these are so good, y'all. They're so heavy. These boots are so heavy. I don't even, let me see. Girl, there's not even any stuffing in this boot and I could barely hold it up, okay? But the boot is absolutely sickening. If you do get these, just let them air out a little bit because you can see the fringe is a little bit um, wrinkled, you know? But let me know what y'all think about these. I know they're super extra, but I mean, if you're gonna go, you might as well go big, right? <laughs> okay, y'all, so last but not least, I got a pair of boots from Good American. This is my first pair of boots from Good American. I've actually heard really good things about the boots. Now, the color that I really wanted was not in stock, but it was during Black Friday and I think it was like 30% off. So I went ahead and just tried them out anyway. Let me show you. <laughs> these are the boots. So these are some black suede boots. Do you see how long these are? Y'all know my polo legs so short, but if you're tall, now this is a boot and they do fit over the thigh, okay? Um, but they do have like a slouchy effect on too, like when you wear them. So just keep that in mind. I'll post a picture. I'll try them on for y'all and you'll see. Um, the boot though is sick. Look at the heel. The heel of this boot is absolutely gorgeous, okay? And then look at that little toe. I don't know if you can, there you go. You see the cap toe is like in a suede. I love the contrast. So the boots that I actually wanted was the same exact style, but they were like a cognac color in suede with the black cap toe. So, you know, they just stood out a little bit more, but I needed another pair of black suede boots and these are super sexy and tall and just good, you know, with a black sweater, some jeans, girl, you don't even need to do much. You don't need to do much, okay? And if you're taller than me, like I said, wearing these even with like shorts or something and making them come all the way up your thigh, it's a look. It is definitely a look. Highly recommend these. These retail for around $230, so not overly expensive, um, but you can, you know, get them on sale because I find that Good American always has like 25%, 20% little deals. And these, like I said, were 30% um, off during Black Friday. So super cute. Let me know what y'all think about these. I'm excited for every last pair. <laughs> And you still get a dust bag with her boots now. She only gave us one. You know how I feel about the one dust bag, but it'll do. <laughs> okay, y'all. So that's all the boots that I picked up, which is enough. Okay. I hope y'all like this video. I haven't done like a shoe haul or a boot haul in a while. And once I got all these, I'm like, yo, that's enough to do a haul right there. I think it's like six or seven boots here. So let me know what y'all think about the boots. Um, I love them all. Let me know your favorites. Also, let me know some of the boots that you guys are picking up this season. Givenchy has some boots that I love right now. Um, they're not the shark boots. They're the ones that come all the way up the thigh. They're like stretchy with a little clear panel going up the front. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, or maybe those are Gian Vito Rossi. I think those are Gian Vito Rossi. Those are some sick boots, okay? But I think I have enough here. 
Um, and I'm so happy that I was able to get most of these on sale. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And I will talk to you on my next video. Bye y'all.